Um, this is Cherie for Just Nailed It. Today I am going to be playing with some vinyl stickers from Maniology, former Bundle Monster. These are water marble designs, so I'm kind of cheating. Um, I've only tried water marbling twice, so we're not going to go there. I'm going to take this route, try this with some Christmas colors, the red and the green with the white background. On my nails, I have my base coat, first in line by Sunful. Also by Sunful, I have Snowy White. I already have that on my nails to save time. I also have some liquid latex around my nails to protect while I do this. This is my design. It is hollow. So I got my tweezers here. I'm going to use this to pull these up, place it around my nails, and do a fake water marble. Press them down lightly. Oops, this one got kind of messed up. Oh. Let's fix that. Okay, what am I do? Okay, I got my sponge because we're going to be sponging this on. We're going to do all four nails here. I'm sure you can see my thumbnail. Even though I'm going to try to hide as best I can. I broke it. It was my longest nail, I'll show you. It's a stubby nubbin now, and I'm not going to bother doing anything to it. But these are, I forgot what I paid for these off of Maniology. Um, it wasn't much. I got them, like, maybe a week. They're coming from Hawaii, which is kind of cool. Um, this is by Broadway. My red, it is... I know it's called hot chili pepper, but I think it wore off. My green is by Finger Paints. It is called Silk Screen Green. So I'm going to open these bad boys up. Put them on my sponge. When you're going to use your sponges, whether no matter what kind of sponge you're in for, measure it out what size of sponge you're going to need. That way you're not getting too much overlap on your skin. So I'm going to take my red, shake it back and forth on the sponge, get it nice and coated. I'm going to do the same thing with the green. And I doubt that you can see what I'm doing. Kind of overlapping them a little bit. I'm going to go back over the red again. I'm going to do one nail at a time, whoops, and dab. So you got to do like as if you were ombreing your nail. And I really don't think the green is showing up on here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. we got to fix that. I'm going to bring the green up on my sponge a little bit higher. Saturate that and go back over my red section again. Not quite down as far, and I'm going to bring it up a little bit further on my nail so the green can get in there. I'm going to go back over my sponge again. Let me see this. This will be my last round. I'm going to get my tweezers and pull this up. And this is also going to pull up, whoops, the liquid latex around my nail. There we go. My little fake water marble. 
Oh, that's the spot. I didn't pull this up. So I'll get that right there with the tweezers. Sorry. A little bit of cleanup, but not much. I think that's kind of cute. Go and do my next finger. I'm really worried about my baby nail. I think I'm going to do that one next because I'm going to really have to come up on this nail to get the green on it. Okay, I'm going to take it over to the next nail also. Layer my sponge back up. Go back over my little finger. Dab, dab, dab. Take it over to the ring finger. I'm going to go over it one more time. It's not so much the red, it's the green. The green's not very pigmented. I wish it was. Let's start with the ring finger this time. Try to get more of the green on the nail. will be my last swap on this nail. Take it over to this one now. Dab, dab, dab. Okay, we are finished, I believe. Make sure you get all the liquid latex off you. Yep. Peel it off our last. Oh, I'll remove these. Peel it off our last nail. Peel it kind of slow. Sorry for reaching over the camera. Oh, now it stuck to me. And we do a little bit of cleanup to do. Let's see. Oh boy. I don't see my cleanup brush. Oh, there it is. Got my pump dispenser. I'm going to go down each nail on the side walls. Clean my mani up. I need a new brush. I do not, and the bad thing is, I don't remember where I bought this at. It is made by, oh, Wet n Wild. So, hmm, I'm going to guess Walmart or the Dollar Tree. That is my guess. So I need to check those out next time I'm in there. Which needs to be soon because I need one. Got polish on my thumb, so I'll clean that off while I'm at it. Run your cuticles a little bit, make sure that's all cleaned up, nothing extra there. And we're done. I'm going to use my Born Pretty No Smudge Top Coat. Just to be safe. Um, I don't know what we're with them is with water marbling. But I'm going to use this. Go over that real lightly. I think this turned out pretty cute. I know it's fake water marbling. It's just using vinyls. But, I like it. I think it turned out really nice. Red, green, and white for the background. And there we go. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think.
He's kind of cute. I mean, it's nothing too serious. But, you know. Maybe I'll dip into water marbling in the new year. We'll see. We'll see where the new year leads me. If you're a new, new uh, viewer, please subscribe. Click the bell. So you get notified of all future videos that I do. If you are an old subscriber, so to speak, thank you for being here. I greatly appreciate it. I think I greatly appreciate your support, your viewing time that you put in watching, your comments, your advice, constructive criticism. Any negative comments will be deleted. Any mean comments will be deleted. This is a positive meal channel. And I thank you all for being here with me along this new journey. I've been on YouTube, um, July was a year. We are now on December. When I post this, it'll be on Thursday, so it'll be the 6th of December. So a year and a half, exactly almost. A year and a half exactly this month. Congratulations to me, just nailed it. <laughs> well, have a blessed day. Thank you.